Hello, I'm Sabina Hassan about the latest news in English on Las Vision TV. Over the past 24 hours, Armenian armed forces have violated the ceasefire along the contact line between Azerbaijan and Armenian troops 29 times using heavy machine guns, reports the Ministry of Defense of Azerbaijan. Meantime, the ministry said the OEC monitoring held today on the line of contact between Azerbaijan and Armenian troops ended without incident. The monitoring took place under the mandate of the personal representative of the OEC chairperson in office, this time in the direction of Azerbaijan's Ardam district. The Minister of Defense, Colonel General Zakir Hassanov, participated in the Joint Tactical Special Exercises of Military Units of the Nakhchivan Garrison under the instruction of the President of Azerbaijan, Supreme Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces, Ilham Aliyev. The Minister of Defense got acquainted with a reliable defense system created at the positions in the recently liberated regions. He met soldiers and officers on the front line and presented valuable gifts to a group of servicemen who distinguished themselves in the service. Minister of Foreign Affairs of Azerbaijan, Elmar Mehmetyarov, met President of Bulgaria, Roman Radev, as part of his official visit to Sofia today, reports the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Azerbaijan. During the meeting, the sides expressed their satisfaction with the high level of relationship between Azerbaijan and Bulgaria. The top diplomats said the two countries attach special importance to deepening cooperation in energy and transport fields. Elmar Mehmetyarov also held a meeting with Speaker of National Assembly of Bulgaria, Tsveta Karayancheva. The sides hailed the development of bilateral relations based on the strategic partnership. They further exchanged views on the other issues of mutual interest. Minister of Energy of Azerbaijan, Pervis Shahbazov, met Minister of Investment and Development of Kazakhstan, Janis Kasambek, in Astana earlier today. The sites noted that the trade turnover between the two countries in the first eight months of 2018 increased by two times and reached $168 million. Pervis Shahbazov underlined the importance of holding meetings of the Joint Intergovernmental Commission. The Energy Minister of Azerbaijan also underscored the need to deepen relations between business circles of Azerbaijan and Kazakhstan. Azerbaijan will open 10 more trading houses abroad in 2019, Yusuf Abdullayev, acting president of the Azerbaijan Export and Investment Promotion Foundation, told reporters on Wednesday. Several trading houses may also open in China, said Abdullayev. He also noted that next year Azerbaijan entrepreneurs will take part in international exhibitions in China and South Korea. And that was all for today from Asvision TV. Our next update will be tomorrow. Thank you for your attention.